of the reporters who wrote about the video basically equated it a little bit to the way Scientology went after um, people who were trying to blow the whistle on Scientology. I is that your assessment as well? Absolutely. I believe, and I've said uh, now in many interviews, uh, and I felt this way even while I was still at SeaWorld, it is it, very much a cult-like behavior. In my opinion, it is, it is a cult. And I believe that I survived a cult. And um, that's my opinion. And um, even, even when I was at SeaWorld um, and still a trainer, I was threatened that you, if you ever leave and speak out, these are the things that will happen to you. And then you would also see it play out with other trainers. If trainers left and they sued SeaWorld, they would be forced into bankruptcy as they were trying to fight the legal team of SeaWorld. Or you would see them leave SeaWorld and try to get another job in the animal field and they'd be blacklisted, you know, and not, not be able to get a job. So it's like if you leave and you cross us, you know, we will get you one way or another. And the, for them, they can't attack uh, my experience. They can't attack um, the facts that are in the book about the whales. They did attack your character. One of the things that they say is that you made a lot of mistakes and that you weren't a good trainer. How, how, what's your response to that? Well, very simply put, I was their creation. If I was uh, this terrible trainer or I had made all these mistakes, um, then why would I have been at Shamu Stadium for so many years and why would I have risen to the, the highest ranks of trainer at, at Shamu Stadium as a senior one trainer, which is even a higher rank than senior, if I was so terrible? So the, again, this is like, you know, very reminiscent of like what they did to Sharon. You know, here she was this elite trainer at, at Shamu and then she challenged them and then all of a sudden, the next thing you know, there's this memo posted up of how she's lost her confidence with her whale with the whales she's making all these mistakes you know it's just an attack on your character um, so you know I was a thorn in management side for years before I left because I was battling over the way that they were caring for their whales so this is very predictable you know behavior by them and I expected it to happen but very simply put if I was such a terrible trainer you know why would you have had me at Shamu Stadium for so many years why would you have promoted me to the highest ranks and even when I left you hired me back and, and continued to promote me even higher once I came back <laughs>